Eddie Hearns here. Um, Eddie Hearns. Eddie Hearns is my parody account yeah. on Twitter. Be careful. Okay. You get me in a lot of trouble. Uh, okay, no problem. Um, Jojo Dan, not quite like the biggest name out there. Mm. Explain the reason why it, why it should be Jojo Dan. He's the number one contender in the division. He's the mandatory challenger for Kel Brook. Kel Brook has a mandatory um, that he has to uphold to. Danny's a, a very good fighter, stylistically a great fighter for Brook. Um, and a chance for Kel to get that mandatory out of the way and unlock the huge fights in the summer. If we didn't fight Dan now, you know, then he has to have a voluntary now, and then he has to fight Dan in the summer. You know, this is a, a tough fight coming back from a horrific injury that nearly cost Kel Brook his life. Um, this is a tough fight, you know, and uh, there's no easy fights in the division, but for me, this is the fight that unlocks the super fights in the summer. Um, him not being a big name, do you think that will reflect something to do maybe with the, the, the viewership and the ratings? Oh really, you know, you've got to do your own thing, you know, if he's got a mandatory defence, he takes that fight, you know, I think anyone who knows boxing, who, who will watch Jojo Dan will know that he's a very, he's a good fighter, stylistically, it's a different fight to Porter, and Brook will fight differently to his court in Porter. The special thing about Kel Brook is he can adapt however he needs to. And against Jojo Dan, Kel will stand and fight, because that's the kind of style that Dan will bring to the ring. Yeah, considering the injury to the left, did that, did that play a part in um, you know, matchmaking uh, the opponent? No. Uh, Jojo Dan was the first choice for us every day of the week. We had to get this mandatory out of the way and you know our discussions with uh, Al Heyman and Lou DiBella over the last couple of weeks we had to get it made and we got it made at about 10 o'clock last night and um, I'm delighted to get it done because like I say it's coming back from the injury you know in a real competitive fight against the number one contender in the division um, and you can't really do more than that. Do you, because you, you know, you're know you doing business with Al Heyman would that mean it's on the NBC uh, network? It might be you know we'll, we'll announce their broadcast partner in America over the next couple of weeks but no, it'll be down to Al to select where he wants it to go. Speaking of um, Al Heyman.